But I expect him to lead us. I expect him. But you were just saying he's not your head. He's the head of the house, and you said I said Christ. Christ Christ is first because he's for both of us. But I follow him. But who's your head? Who's the head of you? Term. Give me the term of that. Who's the head? Who's over you? What do you mean over? Your head. You don't know what that means? I want you, I want you to tell me so that we can make sure we have a clear understanding. Mm-hmm. How should they get their wife to cook and clean and do the things that a wife should do? Submit. Submit to the wife? Submit. Submit. The, the, what do you mean the by wife, submit? The wife submit, the husband submit. What do you mean by submit? How it's does like, one submit? It's like the marriage is a partnership, okay? You can't do, she can't do more than me and I can't do more than her. What I mean, we got to bring equal to the table. A lot of people now, you know, they say, you know, you, the woman have to be beneath you. But that's not how Christ wanted. That's how not, that's, you would not get the, the best resource that way. Before it, you yeah. marry her, did you know that she was willing to cook and clean? Oh, yes. And yes. Cook? Because you guys discussed that prior, right? Yes. All right. That's yes. what a lot of guys and ladies don't do. During the dating period, they do not discuss those things. And then when they get married, it brings conflict because now mm-hmm. they're not functioning well. Mm-hmm. I would um, like to, you know, just inject that a strong marriage is more than just um, cooking and cleaning. Yes. It's yeah. all in coming to agreement and learning to communicate with your partner. You got to work together. Yes. You got to talk. You got to trust each other. Mm-hmm. So... You agree that Maurice is the head of you? Mar- he has been the head, and I, 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 I put him there because I know my place, um, and and I know where God has put me, and you he is the head of the up. household, not the head of me. He's the head of the household. He's the, he's the, he's the one. So he's not the head of you. He, Christ is the head of me. But your right? husband is supposed to be the head. And he is the head of the household. And we, I follow him as he follow Christ. Amen. And my children follow uh, us. Let me just ask, mm-hmm. did you know you're not the head of your wife, but the house? Oh, yes. You I knew mean, that? It's just, it's just, but you just told me you're the head of your wife. But this is the thing. Uh-uh. As the word. As the word, as the word kicking. That's why, brother, we got to keep your scripture. Yeah. It has see, to be. That's why I see. But what does the, scripture, does the scripture say? You're the head of your wife or you're the head of the house? It, it said mm-hmm. the man is the head. Of what? Mm-hmm. Okay. Is the head based over the church? No. What did the, the wife. So and did the Bible say you're the head of your wife or the head of the house? The head of the house. No, the Bible doesn't say that. Me included. The right. children. No, but what does the Bible say? He He's the head. Of what? He's the head of the household. The Bible doesn't say that. <laughs> what does it say? Man is the head of his wife as Christ is the head of man. That's right. fine. But you guys saying that he's the head of the house. Mm-hmm. You said he's not the head of you. Well, the way you word it, but he's the head of the house and all of us. But that's not all scripture. He leads though. us. He that leads doesn't us. work. He leads us. But why are you deviating from that one? And I'm asking because a lot of people want to know these things and mm-hmm. they're having a rough time. Mm-hmm. And they are married women who will accept that he's the head of the house, mm-hmm. but they won't accept he's the head of me. Because they got, they're not grounded. See, That's we are grounded but you're in not saying that. You're not saying he's the head of you. We are grounded. We are grounded. So is Maurice the head of you? Is, is he the head of me? Yes. In what way? As your husband, your head, head is he the head of you? I follow him as no, he follows Christ. That's not Christ. what I'm asking, though. Is he the head of you? If he wasn't a godly man, then there would be a difference. One more time. Is he the head <laughs> of you? Is he the head of me? Yeah. As he follows Christ. Yes. Amen. So Maurice is the head of you. He's the head of me as he follows Christ. And only. Um, what do you think about that? I'm cool with that. This is so important because I know a lot mm-hmm. of, and I counsel mm-hmm. a lot of Christian mm-hmm. couples. Mm-hmm who they have a major deal with this now, mm-hmm. where the wife would not accept that her husband is the head of her. They'll say the head of the house, but that's not what God said. That's mm-hmm. not what the scripture said. Did the Bible say that the man is the head of his wife? Yes. I'm sorry? I'm, I'm like this. Did I'm the like Bible this. Answer that I'm first. Like this. Just yes. so sort of people know. We, he made that the head, the husband the head. Of what? He did that. Gotcha. Of what? The home. No. The did church. he make him the head of the wife? It comes a 50-50. And that's okay. what the Bible says? It comes a 50-50. Does the Bible say that? The Bible says, I'm the head. 
Do you see how tough this is? You got to want to admit it's, your it's, 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 you it's not that, tough. Then Anita said on, no. It's, it's not, not, no, house. it's not and now tough. Now you're checking it out. No, it's not tough because we know our place. Uh-huh. See, it's tough. It's no, tough we to talk about what the scripture say, though. Okay. What does the scripture say? I'm, I have no problem. So you guys exactly. want to admit that? That's a problem. It's not a problem. What? It's a problem to people that don't know order. But That's right. The order of okay. God is God in Christ, Christ in man, if you man want over move. woman, and woman over children. Mm-hmm. Isn't that the order? Mm-hmm. Is that the order, Nita? I have no problem with that. Is that the order? See, the thing is, the thing is, when you say that, we have to make sure, because not everybody Amen. is, does everybody that look at this program, are they Christians and understand the order? And but don't Christ doesn't us. care about that. Christ care about the order, and as children of God, mm-hmm. we should just care about the order. If somebody's going to misread that, that's on mm-hmm. them. I'd rather tell them the truth mm-hmm. so they have another way of thinking and seeing things mm-hmm. than to say that the man is the head of his house. When Christ clearly says he's the head of his wife. Mm-hmm. And that's the problem. If you don't have the order there, it's not going to work anyway. Well, I think that's why we need to make sure that we listen to the one that's telling us. If Amen. they're listening and they're reading that scripture, exactly. then they should believe the scripture and that they follow Christ. But you guys don't seem to believe it. This is, this is what it is, brother. This is what it is. See, we already know who we are. Can't nobody change that. You can't change that. We can't change that. But we're that. not talking this about who you are. are. We're talking wait, about wait, the, wait, the one second. Life. wait one second. What I'm saying is this. All right. Now... We understand what the word say. We follow Christ. The Bible said, and you should know the truth, and the truth should make you free. What does that I ain't have in to prison do with being no the head of your wife? I ain't in prison no more. I'm not. This is what I'm saying. We have respect for each other. That's the thing. That's okay. Not, that's not the question, though. The question well, is the order, because we need to get the family back in order. Mm-hmm. And in the good old days, when boys were boys and men were men, mm-hmm. men and women understood that order. Women mm-hmm. knew that mm-hmm. their husband was the head of them, mm-hmm. and that uh, they get their love and instruction from their husbands, and they pass it down to the children. Because we've allowed secularism to creep into the church, mm-hmm. The, the, the Christians are sounding like the world. They're afraid to say that the man is the head of his wife, and the wives are afraid, won't admit it. She didn't have a problem. I, I don't have a problem. And exactly. she said how? She said you're no. not her head. She didn't. She, me, she I didn't said me included. included. But I you, expect him to lead us. I expect him to But you were just saying he's not your head. He, he's the head of the house, and you said I said Christ. Christ, Christ, Christ is first because he's for both of us, but I follow him. But who's your head? Who's the head? Of you. Term, give me the term of that. Who's the head? Who's over you? What do you mean over? The, your head. You don't know what that means? I want you, I want you to tell me so that we can make sure we have a clear understanding. Because a lot of it, you're saying it sounds natural, and then there's a spiritual side also. He's not talking about just washing dishes and washing clothes in the house but to no do one certain has said things. That, no. I didn't say that that's either. natural. But see, that's natural. But what the key is that God was talking in the spirit, things of the spirit, because as he's a, talking about that. As a married woman, Christ is not your head. Your as, husband is your head, and Christ is the head of him. And I, then I follow him. But you said Christ he is the head. That he's, but do you agree Christ is not the head of you? Are you trying to say, I, I don't go to Christ, I got to go through him in yes. order to get to Christ? Exactly. That is not the word. You could go around your <laughs> husband to get to Christ? That is not the word. So tell me, can you go around your husband to get to Christ? That I go with my husband. Can you go around him? We come into agreement and we stand and we believe and I support him. He supports me because it also says that the man should submit himself also unto the wife. You know, a lot of guys have a hard time, and the reason I know this, I'm dealing with this, I'm, you know, I'm counseling a lot of people, and these are some of the things the guys want to know. When you wake up in the morning and you're all happy, or you come home from work and you're feeling good, you had a good day, and Anita is upset about nothing, you know, she's mad or carrying on, you know, you say, like, what, what's wrong, honey? Nothing. Uh, well, why are you acting that way? I'm not acting no kind of way. How do you deal with that in her, that hell that's in her? How do you deal with that when it comes up? I don't deal with that. <laughs> what do you do? I don't deal with it. What that do you don't do? happen. 
When, what, it mean, what you mean it doesn't happen? It don't happen. How does he deal with you when that comes up? <laughs> I'm going to tell you exactly the reason why he say he don't deal with because he let the Lord deal with me. So have a when personal that comes relationship. up, your husband don't deal with it at all. He just let the Lord he, deal with he'll let me, He knows that God is going to deal with me. He oh, knows that, so that God's going to calm me down. Why but, doesn't he correct you when you're like that? Because the you, responsibility of the husband no, no, no. is to help the wife to overcome the hell that's in her. If I'm doing something that is true, totally out of the will right. of God, then I expect him to get me back on the right track. Yeah. You Are you know? disappointed when he won't deal with it? He just let the Lord deal with it? Do you feel disappointed no, as a no, wife or a woman? No, no, no whatsoever because he understands my relationship with the Lord. And I respect his relationship with the Lord to understand that even if we but have... God gave a, him that responsibility to correct you so that you can overcome that hell and come into his heaven.